Good evening. That's exactly right. Now, out of those nearly 30 that you mentioned, nine of them are from Milwaukee. And tomorrow morning, two more people will load up this truck with supplies and head out. It's a very big commitment. More than two dozen volunteers from Wisconsin heading to Hurricane Matthew promise to help for two weeks. Our media concern is making sure that people have uh, their emergency need covers so that they've got food, shelter, um, nice place to stay. Nicole Gulotz with the Red Cross explains they don't even know where they're going yet. Local volunteers could be headed to Florida, Georgia, or the Carolinas. It's always, you know, you're kind of waiting for the disaster to happen and you don't know at this point exactly what's going to happen. So for now, we're kind of planning for whatever, whatever comes up. Tomorrow morning, two more volunteers will load up a truck with supplies like these and head for the disaster zone. Distribute meals, distribute relief items such as cleanup kits um, so that people can get their lives back to normal. And of course, we don't know how long it will take to get back to normal. And that woman with the Red Cross who we talked to earlier today explained she might even be going at the end of November because this relief effort could take months. Live in Milwaukee, I'm Adrian Pedersen, WISN 12 News.